What the f the fuck was that? Do you see how many people out there? So it was disgusting. The red, the water's like, like maroon. There's dead fish everywhere. 40 inch snook bloated and dead rotting right there. What the fuck is wrong with people? I don't care how much you pay for a fucking vacation. That, hey, here, let's go take our vacation in filth and rotting death everywhere. That sounds like a great way to go fucking spend our time on. Oh, I don't get it. Well, I'm back in town a little bit early few days earlier than planned um every report i've seen coming out of sarah has been pretty rough uh but we're gonna do the long haul today i'm gonna go north south i'm gonna hit as many spots as i can because i'm off work since i thought i'd be out of town longer so might as well just go see what everything looks like today get it all nice and documented so here we go up at indian beach right now wasn't much of a smell pulling in so i didn't put my mask on um but i'm not gonna i'm not gonna go out somewhere nasty without a mask today anyway uh, it's really high tide out here right now. I'm not sure if that makes a difference, but let's check out the water. Look at that. Looks like mostly just bait fish. It stinks. Um, rotting fish bodies all over. Um, I see some floaters. Yeah, plenty of floaters. These guys are. Not sure what that is. It stinks. Yeah, pretty bad down here. Seeing some bigger fish. Lots of death. Lots of death, lots of floaters out here in this corner. Well, Burt Key looks better than it did the other day. There's still some older dead shit on the, floor, on the shore here, but I'm not seeing, I'm not seeing any floaters. There's a, there's a wind coming from behind me, pushing the water that way. I was just over at Indian, Indian Beach over there and it was covered. So, I mean, the wind's probably shoving a lot of dead bodies and corpses all, all over, um, that direction i mean it's pulling pretty hard behind me right now i'm up here at the cortez beach middle pier um this is as far north as i'm gonna go i'm gonna start putting this mask on just because i can't it messes with my breathing too bad people are gonna think i look silly probably but don't care i'm not sure if the camera will hear me with this thing on either um so i just want to say i'm at the cortez beach middle pier and then we go down to longboat um pass and a couple of spots on longboat key and um see how it is so uh. There's people out here surfing and swimming and shit, so maybe it's not that bad. <laughs> fucking surfing and this shit. People are crazy. into the parking lot longboat pass I'm coughing um like long exaggerated scratchy coughs um so I'm gonna keep my mask on I don't really give a shit if people think I look weird I think they look weird hanging out of this water so anyway uh here's longboat pass um in this next shot look at that shit really making me want to cry. That was a really big red. That was probably 35, 36 inch red. That's bigger than any red I've ever caught. Now it's dead. Done. Going over the 
Longboat Pass right now, man. That water looks like shit. God. That's gross. Up here at the northern end, the northern tip of, um, of Longboat Pass, or uh, Longboat Key Beach, Gulf side. We'll check it out. It's amazing how you can go from just like half mile and the breathing's so different. Again, I, I don't know how much the wind is playing into this because um, it is really windy. <coughs> okay, I'm definitely scratching a little. Um, yeah, I don't know. I haven't seen a single dead fish up here though. So this is where it was in my last video last week that was really, really bad absolutely the worst i'd seen yet so we're gonna check it out here it's been a week i, I think they've started some cleanup out here so I think it's better. dead horseshoe crab big one a lot of puffers starting to wash up a lot more puffers than, than where i don't know what that means looking pretty old well it's not not as bad out here. Oh, it stinks. Not as bad out here as it was last time. I don't know if they're doing a cleanup, but there's a lot of dead bait uh, that seemed pretty old. And then all these puffers. I don't get why there's so many puffers now. There, I didn't see a single puffer last week, and now I'm seeing them everywhere. Go check out Lido Beach here at the main parking area. A lot of fucking people out here. A lot of fucking people. people fucking swimming in that shit it i feel like i just got gassed i took my mask off at my car there's people swimming in that shit oh god people are crazy a lot of floaters here i can see them already a lot of floaters oh god flies everywhere it's gross so many floaters out here. South, man, South Lido is in bad shape. All right, we're out here at Shell Beach now. There's really no telling to be out here. So we were just at Lido over there and it was just absolutely horrid. Oh, gross, yeah, there's some dead shit here. A lot of dead shit up uh, all the way up here. So I finally got the shell. Pull it. Little mangroves, gigantic mahara. Yeah. Oh, this is a sad, sad, sad sight here, man. Oh. What is that? Is that a huge pop of air with permit? Yeah. I don't know, it's hard to tell you what that is. Maybe a spade. Dead snook. Yay. Put a few floaters down here at the end. You can see them out there. 
Missed this one on the way out. Big ass grouper. That's a big one right there, man. The old dead boy. So someone just linked me a, um, an article from the Herald Tribune, a clipping uh, that I found really interesting. So it said that manatee beaches have been trying to stay ahead of their their red tide impact by cleaning up beaches like crazy. Like they're putting a ton of effort into cleaning up dead fish every day since it started showing up here strongly. Um, but it said the Sarasota County has not. Now, I don't know how this article is, maybe a few days, but it said last week alone, it got 10 tons of dead fish off Manatee beaches. That sucks. But what I've seen today so far has shown me that Manatee beaches look way freaking better than Sarasota right now. Sarasota is looking horrible. And this is what I was saying last week is why are people, why did we not have people out here cleaning fish already? Like we should have been doing this from the beginning, what was the hesitancy? What is wrong with our, our county officials to delay and wait so freaking long until the death is literally rotting east of 75 before they're willing to, to, mm, it was fucking infuriating. much rotting dead shit out here. God, it's disgusting. So gross. Look at this shit. Piles of them. There's people fucking swimming. Swimming out there. What the fuck are they thinking? Fresh dead bait, still bloody. People fucking swimming in this shit. Dead shit all the way down. The water was fucking awful. stupid fucking kid out here in our protected uh, grass and stuff. This is protected shit. You're not supposed to go in there, you ding dong. What the, f the fuck was that? Did you see how many people were out there? She was disgusting. The red, the water's like, like maroon. There's dead fish everywhere. 40 inch snook bloated and dead rotting right there. What the fuck is wrong with people? I don't care how much you pay for a fucking vacation. That, hey, here, let's go take our vacation in filth and rotting death everywhere. That sounds like a great way to go fucking spend our time on. Oh, I don't get it. So out here at the North Finnish Jetty, it doesn't seem too bad. Um, I'm hoping but it's okay over here. I'm even going to cast a line for a minute and see if there's any fish biting. Um, I haven't seen any dead fish yet. The water's dark because it's an outgoing tide and there's a lot of uh, rainwater and runoff that's getting pushed out right now. But that's not, that's not red tide technically. It doesn't seem too bad compared to the other beaches. Really old dead bait here, but I'm not seeing anything fresh. Yeah, it's definitely 
Definitely not that down here. Water looks better. Love to surfing. I still don't think I'd swim in it, but it doesn't seem too bad down here. The water actually looks okay on the far south side there. It's a nice color. You can see where it breaks to being a muddy red line out there, but that's that's literally just this all this runoff into coastal water getting pushed out. Here. Doesn't look too bad. I think still be some decent fishing down here. Hopefully, I'm gonna check it out tonight or tomorrow. Pass a little bit. I just like that I can breathe. It's really making me happy. So that's it. That's the tour today. Um, it looks like Sarasota is by far the worst. Uh, Siesta Key, Lido, Big Pass, Shell Beach, all that's pretty pretty damn rough. Um, I don't understand why they haven't started cleaning it up yet. It doesn't make any sense. What are we spending our money on? Um, Venice Jetties seem the cleanest so far. You can breathe well out here. Um, didn't see any floaters at all and just a few few dead ones um, in the sand little 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 baits so um, yeah that's that's where we're at I really wish Sarasota County would start cleaning the beaches it makes a big difference when that rot doesn't wash back into the water and feed to bloom it's pretty obvious what's happening there